Hello everyone. Today I'm going to do a video response to Looney Spin Show um, about the OnlyFans. Now, before I talk about what he said, I'm going to read this verse right here, okay? Deuteronomy 23, verse 17. There shall be no whore of the daughters of Israel, no sodomite of the sons of Israel. Thou shalt not bring the hire of a whore or the price of a dog into the house of the Lord, thy God of any vow. For even both these are abominations unto the Lord thy God. Okay. Now, he also, uh, the Lord also said, Thou shalt not lend upon usury to thy brother, use your money, use your victuals, use your anything that is lent upon usury. Okay. Meaning, selling your soul by um, giving your body up in lust and fornication. And horrorism is not of God, is of Satan, okay? And I want to clarify something to Looney Spin Show. He made a remark about women that getting on the OnlyFans, okay? Now, let me clarify something. The women that gets on the OnlyFans are not women of the Lord, okay? Um, men, y'all need to scratch that out your head that a lot of women wants to get do this, okay? Looney Spence Show, I want to clarify something. You say, it's, oh, oh, it's only women next door. It's a lot of women want to get it, do that. No, it's not. Um, yes, it might be a lot of women, but it's not. You have to clarify what type of women, okay? That's what I meant. You won't need to clarify what type of women. There is a difference between the type of women that's out here. And you men are totally disregarding the Christian, the actual Christian women. I ain't talking about the ones that want to pretend. The actual Christian women that do not want to be involved in that. Okay. Y'all would totally disregard us and look at these worldly women. Okay. And say, oh, and use these worldly women as an example of all women. Just like men would, uh, women would use these worldly men as an example of all men. There is a difference between worldly men and men of God. There is a difference between uh, worldly women and women of God. Okay, I want to clarify this because we have some people online that is trying to mingle everything in a box where there is a difference between the righteous and the wicked. There is a difference. Okay. Not every woman wants to be on the OnlyFans. Not every, one, every woman wants to be a whore. Not every man wants to be a pimp. But there are pimps and there are whores. Okay? I just want to clarify that. Because he said, oh, it's like all these women, there's a lot of women thinking about it. Not me. Okay? I totally disregard the industry because I did not want to sell my soul. Okay? There's a just like you say, there's levels to that. And I'm going to leave that description box below of what he said, okay? There are levels to the game. The levels are, besides what you said, the more higher up you go in the game, the more wicked, okay? So, therefore, if these girls want to be pimped out that way, they will have to get more and more wickeder. The more they go up in the game. That is what we need to establish here. Okay. Because they start off with this. Um, sinful mode of. Showing their bodies off. To, to these fans of lustful people. And then. The more they get higher up in the game. The more it's more. It's, it's more lustful. It's more wicked. They got to do more abominations. And people don't tell them the truth. Because everybody is idolizing money. And I'm trying to get people to see. The more you idolize money, the more Satan say, yes, I got a soul here, buddy. Okay? You people must wake up and realize that your soul is way more at the price. It's the reason why Satan wants it. And it's the reason why he using money to exchange for your soul. Okay? That is where y'all must have a... 
sound mind and an intelligent mind to realize that. Okay. Um, I'm going to leave his description box below. I'm going to leave another video too in the description box below where it shows a, a Filipino drama talking about this woman selling her soul to this man. Notice what they do. The more higher up you get in the street, the more fornication, the more murdering, the more the more lying, backbiting, deceit, the more demons you come across, okay? More legion. And the more wicked are demons because some demons are more wicked than others, okay? Tell the truth here, okay? Looney Spence, I understand you trying to tell people that these women are not understanding that they're getting into an industry that they will reap what they sow, okay? But you you have to hate it, man. You can't say, oh, I don't hate it. Because that is that is a form of wickedness here, okay? That is selling their souls to Satan. You must hate that. You cannot love that. Any man that love a whore is wicked, okay? Any man that love what whores do, is wicked because you're not supposed to be loving sin you're supposed to be hating it see that's the problem with people today they want to love sin and you cannot love the sin you got to hate when people do sin you know if you want to be righteous people you cannot be out here saying you don't hate sin okay you cannot be doing that you can't go out here and say you don't hate sin you have to hate sin if you wants to be righteous okay Righteous people hate sin. They don't love it. They don't say, I'm not hating on it. You're supposed to hate on it. Okay? Because it's not right. What they're doing is not right. Why would you love that unrighteousness in the first place? Ding, 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 ring a bell. Okay? This is what is going on in this world today. People are not honest and don't want to be honest and tell the truth, full truth, that these people should not be doing this mess in the first place. And the women that he say claim that don't care, they will care once they get up more and more up in the industry because they're going to want to have be out and they can't because once you sell your soul, you are stuck in that industry till death. That's just how it is. Okay. Because once you reject the king and the father, which is your life, which is Jesus Christ is the life, then you are selling your soul to Satan who is of death. You are have accepted death. To go and die. That's how dangerous this game is. You cannot reject the king people. And think you will live on. It won't work. Women. If you getting, if you going into this adult industry. And selling your soul. To fame and fortune and money. You will weep what you sow. You will go to hell. Okay. It's just obvious fact. God is not going to allow a whore into his house he's not okay and in order to turn away from fornication you must repent okay but selling your soul you are stuck in that game because it's, it's an oath to it you are stuck in that game for internal oath to satan and that is not good okay because you have rejected the king who is your life to only give you your life to live on Therefore, God has disowned you because you disowned him first. Now you are in that game with Satan. Okay. And Satan can kill you off in that game. You will die along with the rest of them and suffer hell. That's just how it works. And if you people don't wake up to this mad mess that these Satanists are teaching you, you will be caught up in this mess. Real much so. I'm hearing y'all just not, y'all on here, y'all want to say the truth and saying how these people are doing this mess, but yet y'all quick to say y'all not hating it. Do not do that because you're supposed to hate that sin. You ain't supposed to love it. You're not supposed to love it, people. Okay? Sin is not of God. Sin is of Satan. You're not supposed to love what Satan do. And if you do, you are a Satanist and you are of the devil. Therefore, you are not getting into the kingdom of heaven being Satanic.
So I just wanted to clarify that there's a difference between the women of God and the worldly women of Satan. There's a difference between the women of, I mean, the difference between the men of God and the worldly men of Satan. There's a difference, people. Let's clarify that. Okay? People, serve this word here. Jesus Christ is God.